Welcome to the Common Man Football Show. My name is James Coburn, and today's episode, we're talking about the 2018 NFL Draft Class, and specifically talking about Derwin James' safety out of Florida State in terms of his production analytics. And if you're new to the channel, uh, just to give you a quick uh, sort of synopsis about what production analytics is, or at least what market share data is, market share or defensive market share specifically is where you take an individual defensive statistic and you divide it by the team total statistic. Uh, so for example, if a safety has two interceptions on a team that has nine interceptions, uh, then that safety has 22% give or take uh, interception market share. Uh, but what you do is you take that performance, so you do all the market share data for every single safety since the 1989 NFL draft class, and then you have a way of comparing where the multiple all-pro safeties typically performed in terms of their production metrics, where the, the Pro Bowl safeties typically performed in terms of production metrics, and then of course where just regular starters performed in terms of their production metrics. What we're going to look at today is we're going to look at Derwin James in terms of one where he fell when it came to his production analytics in terms of solo tackle market share, interception market share, and pass deflection market share. And we're going to look at and see where he kind of ended up in terms of him as a free safety and him as a strong safety because there is a difference between how a all pro free safety performs and how a all pro strong safety performs in terms of the data. Uh, so first off, let's look at Derwin James in terms of him as a free safety. Uh, in terms of his overall data, Derwin James didn't do that bad. Um, had a 76.08 um, solo tackle market share score, 72.52 interception market share score, and an 88.70 pass deflection market share score. Based on this data, he is a Pro Bowl safety. Um, doesn't quite meet the all pro standards uh, in terms of interception market share and pass selection market share. It's important to note that all pro, is, we're talking about guys like Earl Thomas, we're talking about guys like Ed Reed, uh, Eric Weddle. We're talking about those types of guys. And, and Derwin James didn't perform like those types of guys, but he did perform well enough to become a potential Pro Bowl free safety, which is what a lot of people view him as. And when you look at him through the eyes as a strong safety, uh, he misses the mark in terms of all pro thresholds when it comes to his solo tackle and his uh, interception market share. But there is a very good chance that he could be a Pro Bowl strong safety just because of, of the, uh, the interception market share and, of course, the pass deflection market share. He's a little bit off from the minimum threshold for Pro Bowl free safe, uh, strong safeties Excuse me, when it comes to his solo tackle data. But... It's not too far off to say that it is in a realm of possibility that he could become the next standard, I guess, for that type of um, you know, production mark. Um, so, so keep in mind that, again, if, if players are like a point away, it's within the margin of error that they're in that sort of range. If they're like five or ten points away, then it is a concern. Uh, but with German James's case, I think it's clear based on his data, whether you're looking at him, looking at him as a free safety or looking at him as a strong safety, is that he's a very good chance of becoming a Pro Bowl safety either way based on his overall production uh, analytics. However, again, just important to note, All Pro is not exactly on the cards with him. Uh, he doesn't quite have the really, really rare production marks of a Sean Taylor, of a... Uh, Troy Polamalu even, or Eric Weddle, or or Ed Reed, or Eric Earl Thomas, etc. So those are really the only areas um, where he's a little bit off the mark. Uh, but a Pro Bowl safety is still a very, very good safety to consider, especially in the first round. So Derwin James definitely hits all the marks in terms of that. It's just I wouldn't exactly value him as a generational safety prospect, is all I'm trying to say. Uh, and of course, uh, my name is James Coburn. You can find my other work at draftcoburn.wordpress.com. You can also follow me on Twitter at Gymmetrics. And if you like this content and you want more content like this, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Share this video as well with anybody that you know. Hit that notification button so that you're always reminded when another video of mine drops. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Peace. Peace.